Based on this, if you went ahead and tried using a family member's Google account and you got suspended instantly as well, it looks like you got perma banned by Google. What the heck is that? And you said Google won't reactivate when you ask their customer service. And you know that you can't just set up a new account. So it looks like you've been perma banned where they've actually banned your IP address. Like your own account got banned and when you use a family member's account, that got banned straight away. That means you're most likely IP banned. So what you need to do next, Ross, use another family member's account, but use a virtual desktop, something like Incognition, Multi-Login. I use one called um, Session Box, and then connect in a residential IP that is nearby your family friend's house, but it's not your own IP. So let's say I live in West Sydney. I'm just going to use Sydney's IP. And with that setup, you should be able to create a new Google Ads account. Obviously, I can definitely recommend you to diversify and get into TikTok ads, Facebook ads as well. If you really want to do Google because you've gotten results, that's sort of what you need to do. So one, find a family member's account. Two, use something like multi-login that will sort of give you a virtual desktop and virtual sort of cookies. Three, use a residential IP address. Yeah, that would be the setup on how you can sort of get back onto Google Ads. Hopefully that gives you the solution on what to do when you're perma-banned on Google. If you want, I am offering one-on-one -on -one coaching. If you really, really want to sort of figure out your advertising situation, diversify, learn how to buy, source, new profiles, all that good stuff, and have me sort of walk you through that setup that I just mentioned over your shoulder side by side. If that is something you're interested in, three steps. One, I definitely would want you to go through my reviews. If, you, if this website's not working, this YouTube and in my reviews on YouTube and look for sort of videos that look similar to you and sort of listen to their story so you sort of know what I'm trying to achieve and the types of clients I work with. Next is I definitely would want you to go through my YouTube content, my Instagram content, just to see my results, my students and sort of get to know if you'd even want to work with me and if we're the right fit. And if you do one and two and you still sort of want to work with me one-on-one -on -one to get me to guide you through all those things that we just mentioned one-on-one -on -one over your shoulder over zoom message me on instagram or send me an email and i can definitely sort of jump on a call with you if you're serious and we can go over your situation and see if we will be a right fit for each other but yeah hopefully that helps ross and hopefully i was able to answer your question peace